Intro song. Channel update edition. Hello everyone and welcome to the Gyrick Gaming Channel. My name is Gyrick and today we're doing something a little bit different. Today we are going to do our channel's first channel update. We haven't done anything like this up to this point. I think the closest we've gotten was when the admin did his one subscriber celebration last year. Wonder whatever happened to that guy. So it's kind of a vlog style video, a bit informal. I'm going to uh, talk just a little bit about what the channel is, why we're here, where it's going, uh, those kinds of things. And uh, now a gaming channel. There's some people that I know are probably a little confused by that because I've been on the internet for a very, very long time now and uh, mainly doing things that are not uh, gaming videos. <laughs> and so a few of them might be a little confused of like, why gaming videos of all things? Now, I am a gamer. Now, I've been a gamer for probably longer than I've been just about anything else. So really, that part's not so strange. I've spent, let's, let's just say, a lot of time gaming over the years. So that was something I was going to be doing anyway, I suppose. Now, on the side of uh, YouTube, uh, I didn't always use YouTube for being YouTube, if that makes sense. I put an account together so I could put some concert videos up because I had no other way of showing anybody on any other pages. Uh, places I put it before uh, uh, aren't there anymore. So pretty much the page stood dormant for years and then I started getting really into watching YouTube and seeing what it was about. And I gotta say I love YouTube very much. Not just because they're always listening. But it's like what YouTube is is capable of, what you can accomplish on YouTube. Uh, not talk about just like, you know, being a, a game caster or a streamer or anything like that. Um, you can take entire college courses on YouTube. You can, uh, you, know, you can learn pretty much any weird, random, uh, don't try this at home style thing you could possibly think of. It's entertainment, it's arts, it's expression. So I love YouTube. I'm a big fan of YouTube. And I started thinking one day that, okay, so I love gaming and I love YouTube. Is there some way that I can combine those two in such a way that I no longer have enough time to do either one? Editing. Yes, that's right. Gaming. <laughs> gaming videos. Which was kind of an interesting leap to make because I have absolutely no experience doing any kind of editing or I don't know anything about bit rates or recording audio or I don't know. Or I, at the time, I didn't know how to even capture uh, what's on your screen into a video. Well, what to do with it after that. Um, I, I had literally none of the equipment and none of the software to do any part of it. And so I figured, all right, let's do this. And then that is essentially how it started. I had a few uh, inspirations I'd been following uh, up to that point. You know, I was a big fan of, uh, you know, Trollcraft, you know, a big fan of, you know, Jack stuff and Markiplier. Um, you know, some of the big gamers, still a big PewDiePie fan, even though he doesn't do that much gaming anymore. So starting out uh, on the editing side, because that ended up being the majority of what the whole experience <laughs> was was just trying to figure that out on my own from scratch. Uh, fittingly and ironically enough, I learned of some of it from watching YouTube videos. Uh, there's a lot of good stuff out there from other YouTubers talking about their experience. But uh, learning how to edit from scratch is hard and doing it with, uh, start out with the absolute wrong software <laughs> is even more difficult. Man, my uh, software to start out with would crash every few minutes in some cases when it was behaving very badly. Uh, it bogged down my computer. I was using these massive file sizes. And then when I tried to render it into a, a video, it would get like so many percentage through and then it would like crash I have to start over. And we're talking five and 10 hours to get into a video from a file. 
and it might be hour seven or eight before I find out that it crashed. Like I'll start it rendering before I go to bed and I'll get up and it'll be like, And then uploading it, uh, I would sometimes find out there that the uh, video had uh, bugs in it because it wouldn't work at YouTube at all. So it was uh, it was quite a challenge, especially since every other video at least I was trying something completely new that I hadn't tried before. And uh, and in my videos, I started out doing hundreds of edits when I did my first uh, Minecraft videos, and uh, I was still working on. How do you even narrate? You know, what What are you supposed to say while you're playing? Things like that. You know, I, I should do a whole separate video just on uh, really looking at the experience of trying to do this from scratch. Uh, I'm probably not ready for that yet because uh, I am still doing it from scratch. It's still a new channel and I'm not really at a point where I can do that much reflecting other than uh, what I've done so far. So, yeah. Now, as far as the gaming itself, about me gaming on this channel, um, what the videos, what to expect, that kind of thing, uh, I think an important thing to know is that I am a completionist with games. Uh, I am really big on finding each thing. Uh, I get irritated at things like the Brenda incident <laughs> or Let's Play I'm doing right now from Bioshock. Probably some time going on there. Don't open the door, Brenda. He's being irrational. He's on the drugs. I don't Yo, think he's gonna open through. up! He's not getting through. Um, I complained about that a little bit too much in the videos, I think, but uh I like just crawling through and finding every possible thing, talking to everyone that I can, just doing all the things. And that isn't always the best thing to sit and watch someone do in a video, right? So uh, that's something I'm trying to figure out right now, actually. Uh, if you're going through and you're crawling through every single step of the way, uh, people get upset that you're going too slow, rightly so, because that's that can get real hard to watch. But then if you just kind of cruise on through, people are going to get upset that you missed things, uh, which I've also seen. So I think uh, I think get good is the moral of the story here. I think uh, get good is the lesson to walk away with this. The other key thing is that I am into the experience of being in the world. I am pretty big on... Uh, the immersion immersion is a huge thing for me because uh it comes out a little bit on how i'm concerned about my character dying <laughs> i don't just like throw myself into it uh that's another gameplay issue for videos but uh, uh i get so involved in being in the world and being a part of it that uh, i probably don't want to get shot in the face too much uh, but i'm working on that and I think a lot of this comes from that I'm I'm from a, more of a fictional background, I suppose, that I was big in uh, reading fiction stories, getting absolutely lost in those uh, for for many years. I was a huge fan of that, uh, doing a lot of, uh, you know, role playing like Dungeons Dragons for years. So that, that's the kind of thing I'm coming from. And that's why I, I really love the role playing video games, the sandbox worlds, a lot of the open ended stories. Uh, so I'm going to be playing a lot of those any chance I get for sure. Uh, character development, you know, narration, conversation trees, all all sorts of stuff that uh, apparently Fallout 76 doesn't have. Shame. So that's basically why I'm here. It's because I like doing it. Uh, even if there's no one watching, I really there's some real sick joy out of making a video. I don't know, I'm just kind of getting down and maybe sounded like I was getting down and editing a little bit earlier on, but. Uh, editing is actually really fun, uh, mostly when you're done. <laughs> okay, that doesn't sound much better. But no, the process of editing um, it is pretty entertaining, actually. And uh, finishing a video and getting it out, uh, that feels pretty good, especially for sometimes taking just days trying to get the thing going. And I, I got new software now, so I've got that part pretty well handled. So at this point, it's just a matter of uh, uh, learning it better. I think. Uh, I mean, so initially I wanted to do, uh, ideally, maybe like a video a week. 
And I'm saying a video a week more because I work more than full time job already. Uh, so I thought that was something that if I figured out, you know, the mechanics of this, that I could do that reasonably and uh, was getting kind of close, maybe three videos a month ish I have to go back and look. But uh, around the end of last year, going into this year, you know, a lot of life stuff happened and uh, videos didn't happen as often. But that is past. I'm getting videos out more often again. I'm doing two series simultaneously right now. That's the uh, Bioshock and Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, I'm trying to go back and forth between them, uh, which is a little more difficult when, you know, you can only do so many videos at a time. And the views uh, is not something I expect too much of when I don't have very much of a following. Uh, with Minecraft videos, I was getting maybe 20 to 40 uh, before I had the kind of stepping away for, you know, six months, something like that. And uh, when I came back, it went from 20 to 40 down to like 10 to 20. But then I did this video here recently that was my first reaction video. It was kind of an impromptu one for the, uh, the one for uh, Atomic Heart, the uh, crazy Russian game that's coming out a year from now. And that one is close to 800 views already and I don't know what to do with that information I feel like there's probably some sort of lesson to learn in there but uh, hopefully I'll figure it out I don't know so if you guys had anything that you wanted to see in particular uh, this might be a pretty good video to leave a comment about it uh, in the meantime, I'm just going to be moving along with uh, the series that I've started. Um, one's coming up. I'm looking forward to. I need to spend more time maybe reading up on what games are coming out when because I end up getting taken by surprise. Like we had the uh, Game Awards the other day, and I found out that it was on, uh, that it was coming out because it had started. And I didn't watch that one. I'm actually going to go through and... Uh, I don't know. I was thinking about doing some videos on those trailers for new games because I think that's something I've been missing out on uh, doing here recently. And the uh, people seem to like the uh, Atomic Heart one. That one was actually quite a bit of fun to make. Uh, so I'm going to try that again while I'm learning what games are coming out at the same time. I think that works out. So if you want to watch a gamer who uh, is very immersive, who really wants to find all the secrets and who's mindful of trying not to crawl through it too much. Uh, if you're someone who's patient like gaming, I suppose, is one way to look at it. Um, why not subscribe? All right, that's about enough of that. Uh, so this is just, uh, man, my first update, but also I guess this is my first vlog, I guess. Well, this would be considered a vlog, right? I'm pretty sure. But if you sat through this this long, um, I much appreciate it. I'll do more video updates in the future as there's more interesting things to update about. Um, thank you for stopping by. I uh, hope to see you guys over in my videos. And uh, we'll see you all again next time.